Hi everyone, today's video is a review of a mirror that I wanted to buy uh, right before Christmas and I was looking at online reviews but none of them was telling me what I wanted and it was whether the Simple Human 5 times magnification mirror uh, with a sensor, like was it good for women over 50? And the reason I was asking that is because most women over 50, even a little under 50, have presbyopia, which means that we need reading glasses. Most of us do anyway. I normally apply my makeup with multifocal contacts, which is what I'm wearing right now. Otherwise, uh, well, even with the uh, contacts, actually, I really do need uh, magnification to see everything like the way I should see it. There have been times before I got this mirror that I'm going to talk about now where even my kids were like, mommy, your foundation is like, it's, it's not properly blended. Or sometimes maybe I had, not kidding, um, hairs above my lip that I hadn't seen and there is nothing that I, well, that's not true. There are things that I fear more than that, but it's just that, you know, why not see myself in the best possible light when I'm applying the makeup so that when I go outdoors, I look good. So this mirror is $200. I got it for 150 because it was before Christmas and there was a sale. Um, I ordered it in white so it would match uh, the room where I apply my makeup and here were my findings. So the magnification is actually perfect when I'm wearing my contacts because usually, um, interestingly, I use a ring that has my kids' names on it and if I can read that, it means that my, my contacts are working. So with the contacts which which improved my vision to almost, almost 2020 when I'm looking at myself in the mirror, then I can see honestly everything, which for me is a good thing because that means that if I can see every wrinkle, every something in my teeth right now that I just noticed, um, it means that I'm going to be able to apply my makeup in a very precise way. So one of the cool things about this mirror is that you charge it with, uh, well, it has a charger that goes into the wall, but then, you know, after, after it's charged, you're ready to go. And it sits on my vanity right there. Um, I will turn it off, hopefully. Okay, there you go. And then watch what happens. So I get close to it and it lights up. And then imagine that I'm, you know, getting some makeup or whatever. Um, it turns off after a while, okay, or it dims. So another cool thing that I like about it is that in the back, it has this, which is white, so you can't really see it very well. But by sliding your finger up and down, it will change the intensity of the light. So there it's brighter and there it's not so bright. And then also if you want to turn it off manually, you can do so by holding your thumb up here, boom, and it's off. So I personally am really excited about it. Now, other women on Instagram, by the way, follow me on Instagram. It's on my profile because that's where I'm most active. Um, I'm learning reels lately. It's a lot of fun. They were telling me in a reel that I posted about this mirror that they need more than five times magnification, and I get it. When I'm not wearing contacts, I need more than five times magnification, possibly even 10. There is another model that is more expensive that has a section that has 10 times magnification. It also still has the five times. Now, what I noticed one day that I wasn't wearing my contacts is that if I held it far enough when I'm not wearing my contacts, I can still see myself. So I thought that was pretty cool. Also, there are two different um, 
two different tones of light. One is um, more like outdoorsy and the other one is a little bit more yellow. But I actually like them both. I'm super pleased with it. Anyway, so if you're thinking, like if you're an over 50 woman, you know, the worst case scenario is I would order it, which is exactly what I did. And if you don't like it, return it. I'm gonna say something. The first unit that I ordered did was defective. I was so bummed because it was right before Christmas and I really, really wanted to use it and it just didn't turn on. And so I wrote to the company and you know they determined it was a defective unit. So I sent it back and, um, and ordered a new one. And then this one worked fine. Now, so anyway, do I recommend it? Yes, I do recommend it, especially more than these mirrors. I got this one years ago. I forget where. I feel that, yeah, no, definitely. This one probably does have at least seven times the magnification because with my um, contacts, I even find it hard to see myself. And then it just has a normal magnification, um, just normal here. Then I'm just going to say that I had read that it was good to have another kind of mirror that had no magnification. So I bought this other mirror. It's funny because now you can see the lights that I'm using to light myself up. But so this mirror I got at Marshalls of all places. I also found it on Amazon. It's by a brand called uh, Vanity Impressions or Impressions Vanity. I'll link it down at the bottom. And things I like about it, well, this has no magnification, but it's nice to be able to see myself up close. This one keeps turning on and off because I'm getting close to it. And say that I'm, you know, doing my eyes here and then I can look in the other mirror and see what I look like from afar. So having both of them is pretty cool. And this one by Impressions, I think this one was 150 as well. Well worth every penny if you make a living um, with your, you know, wearing makeup or just if you're a makeup junkie. This one also has dimmable lights and you can also change the warmth of the lights. So I, yeah, you can see they're changing right there. Anyhow, so if you need to know whether the Simple Human five times magnification sensor mirror is worth it, I'm going to go for yes, it is. And it's even worth it for those of us with uh, older eyes. That said, if you want to splurge a little more, I already mentioned that there's another um, model of Simple Human and it does have a further magnification 10 times. So we'll see. Maybe when I'm older, I'll get that one. But right now, I can tell you this one was worth every penny. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please share it, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And otherwise, I have so many other videos that maybe one of them will be interesting to you.